Hello guys, how's it going? It's Dayton here, Royal Masters. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. I'm having a great day, especially when I got a new Royal Vacuum to review. Okay, so today we got the Zuzu Z50, and a huge thanks to Zuzu for sending me out this awesome little product. Now, this is aimed for more of a budget-friendly user, or someone who does want to spend an arm and leg on a Royal Vacuum. And one interesting thing is, I was going through my videos, I actually counted how many different models I reviewed on this channel. Can you guys guess? It's a 10, 15, 20, 50. Let me know down in the comments how many different Royal Vacuum models I reviewed, and I will let you know at the end of this video. Okay, so I was requested to have my light pillow right here. Yes, I had to bring it back. Someone requested, they're not happy, so I brought back my light pillow. So if you like this video, smash the like pillow. Really does help out my video. And again, thanks, Zuzu. Get that out of there. I need more room. Okay, so the Zuzu Z50 has some interesting things. First, this guy has a crazy, insane battery life. This is a 5200 milliamp hour battery, and this guy runs for up to 290 minutes. What? 290 minutes? That was being out the Ecovacs T8 to 950, that's just craziness. I thought 200 minutes was long, but 290 minutes is just insane, it's bonkers, and yes, there's the specs right there. Also, this guy can cover up to 3,700 square feet or more, so yes, this can cover a very large area. And keep in mind, these specs are probably based on its low power setting, there's actually three power modes on this guy. And this guy also has carbon boost, so what that does is, as it's going on, uh, your carpet would actually boost up the suction if it was going on hardwood floors to carpeting and that's really cool 3,000 pascals on carpeting. It's a really nice uh, Feature I like carpet boost now you may notice all these crazy accessories over here Let's take a quick look you have this little doodad. Well, what is this thing? Well, it's a mopping system It actually has a washable mopping pad right here held on by a velcro also you have a 600 milliliter water tank and it's like a transformer pop it up you got a 400 milliliter dust tank right here folks this is craziness i i've never seen a raw vacuum at this price point that can do mopping and vacuum simultaneously and has a very large water tank 600 milliliter water tank 400 milliliter uh dust bin that's craziness now if you find that this 400 milliliter dust bin is too small well you actually have a main dust, dust bin removed. yes this guy is 600 milliliters so, this guy can definitely hold a lot of dirt on one uh, go around. Now, some additional accessories, you do have a nice remote control. I really like this. Um, one thing that the Royal Vacuum does, it will announce exactly what you're doing. So, if you press the OK button, it will announce that it's in auto mode. If you press the, uh, uh, what is this, the vacuum level, it will actually announce the different vacuum levels. You actually have three different vacuum levels and three different water levels. So, that's really cool. I really like the announce feature. Most of the vacuum should just beep at you, but letting you know what mode it is is a huge, huge uh, touch or a nice plus. Okay, you also have some AAA batteries for your remote, and you got some dual side brushes here. Also, you have an extra filter, magnetic strips. So yes, uh, this guy doesn't wander somewhere you don't want. You can actually block off the area. And of course, you got your nice little docking station. Uh, one thing to note is I do like the fact that you can wrap the cable around. Huge plus. Uh, kind of gives a nice clean setup. Now, one downside is there's no way to put the little remote control up top. I know some docking stations offer a little cutout, but that's just one little minor gripe. And that's basically it. So, uh, as I've been using the Zuzu C50, I actually found this guy to be a pretty good performer. Uh, one thing to note is on the edge clean mode, it does guide the debris around. Even though it has dual side brushes, they do spin a little quickly. So, what I would do is have to go up back into the edge mode and then do it auto clean. So it's great for like a small room, go around the edges first and then do the auto clean. Now this guy does have a smart uh, app and it does work with Alexa, Google and also Siri. That's a rarity. Uh, most of your vacuums only support the two voice assistants but this also supports Siri. So if you have like a iPhone, you can definitely use Siri and control the world vacuum start stop. Um, very cool. Now also this app has a scheduling feature. You also have a live map preview and every time the world vacuum runs it does create a new map so there's no like keep out zones or areas select within the map so that's just one thing to uh, remember when selecting this world vacuum but i found this guy's pretty easy to use you can just take it downstairs take it to your upstairs take it to your friend's place your grandma's place and the nice thing about budget friendly world vacuums is they're super easy to use especially with the remote, remote control you can actually control basically all the functions of the robot without having to use an app. So that's why I really like these uh, robot vacuums.
Okay, so some other interesting things is the spot function. Yes, this thing does have a spot clean function. I did notice that it does scatter the debris around on hardwood floors. So definitely use the spot clean function on carpeting. Also, this guy navigated pretty well. It was able to get itself unstuck in some situations like trying to go into my daughter's dollhouse area. It was able to find a way out. So that's really cool. Um, I think this guy's pretty smart. Now, another thing I noticed is um, once you... Tell it to go back to its docking station and it doesn't know exactly where the docking station is. It will actually kind of bounce around and then use like a right hand rule pattern and just kind of go along the edge until it finds the docking station. So that's a cool feature and the mopping did really well. It's just a normal mopping system. Don't expect it to do like stubborn dirt and grime but just for basic uh, dust and light mopping this thing does fine i was surprised how large the dustbin was and also the water reservoir okay so i think the zuzu c50 is a great little option if you're looking for a great second day you are backing or if you're a first time buyer and you don't want to deal with a lot of features like the smart mapping um this is really handy the remote control allows you to just jump in uh, get started just press the ok button and the thing will start cleaning also one thing to note is i do appreciate having the power button and home button directly on the robot and let's look underneath the robot real quick uh if this is just your typical well vacuum you got your dual side brushes you also have the front wheel caster and it looks like we got what is this four cliff sensors and here's to look at the extractor bar pretty handy but if you need to you can actually take a cleaning tool and just clean off the Hair. So, uh, no issues there. I think this raw vacuum is great for the first time buyer. Okay, so let's go ahead and give you my uh, pros and cons with this guy. And we'll just wrap up this video. So, the pros is the specs are kind of insane. Especially 3,000 pascals. A 5,200 milliamp hour battery offering over 290 minutes. That's just uh, craziness. Um, now, I do like the performance as well. Uh, the 3,000 pascals did pick up with a variety of debris. I did some rice. I also did like some corn chips and some just some random dirt and debris around my house. This guy had no problems picking that up. Now, downsides. Um, so this guy's priced around, I believe, $209. So it's not the cheapest. It's not the most expensive. But for what it is, it does offer a lot of great features. But I think the base downside is kind of loud. Um, you can definitely hear it. So I do recommend turn this thing down, maybe on its medium to low power mode if you're trying to eat dinner or something. Thanks for watching this video on the Zuzu Z50. You guys have a great rest of your day. And I forgot to mention, I reviewed 75 models to date. Yes, 75 different models. So check out my videos if you're interested in getting a raw vacuum or if you just need help. I will be more than happy to answer down in the comments down below and i'll provide the link of this guy if you're interested all right have a great rest of the day i'll catch you later adios